Let's look at a class of numbers inspired by Euclid's famous proof of the infinitude of primes. Those are the Euclid numbers. First, we need to set p n equal to the nth prime, and then e sub n is equal to, this is called the primoral of p n plus one. And this m number sign is the product of all primes less than or equal to m. So we can check that the fifth Euclid number is 11 times seven times five times three times two plus one. That is 2,311. Now these numbers are not always prime. In fact, E6 factors is 59 times 509. Now a big open question is, are there infinitely many prime Euclid numbers? But like I said, that's unknown. It's also fairly easy to show that the Euclid numbers are never squares. Let's look at the nth Euclid number, which can be decomposed into the product of a bunch of odd numbers, which is odd times two plus one, making it of the form four n plus three, but numbers of the form four n plus three are never squares. That's fairly easy to check. So don't forget to subscribe.